Pulse with Pioneer here at NAM 2013, and I want to tell you a little bit about the DD XDJ Arrow White. Uh, Pioneer's released this new white edition of the Arrow. It's a great controller because this is a standalone unit that allows you to use either a USB source or even a Wi-Fi source such as your computer or an Android or iOS device. You can load your tracks directly into it, and you've got two decks control. You've got a built-in mic. Uh, it has a built-in Wi-Fi hotspot that allows you to, to uh, connect to all your devices. Uh, so, it's, yeah, you've got your microphone, you've got two channels, you got this uh, great jog for, uh, for scratching and playback. Uh, we have a new feature on here called the Jog Drum, which allows you to actually uh, sort of launch the, uh, the start of the track and do a little bit of uh, effects just by touching the, uh, the top of the jog, as well as samplers. So you've got four samples you can load in there. And uh, again, this is, uh, it's a great, great unit for uh, mobile guys because it's really slim, really portable, and does all in one. You don't need a computer. You can do it directly off the USB drive. Hey guys, I'm Paul Spioneer, NAM 2013. Check it out, the DDJ SX. This is a, uh, a Serato DJ controller, and this is actually my favorite unit right now. Uh, for those who are familiar with uh, the Serato family of software, DJ is the newest entry. It takes a lot of the features from Mitch and some of the features from Scratch Live and brings them into the controller environment. Uh, Pioneer's released their first controller for it. It is a four-channel controller with these gorgeous, gorgeous platters. They're a new sort of a static, uh, static control. Uh, you have dual deck control, which is something that Pioneer has uh, just innovated. It allows you to actually control both decks at the same time. So if you've got two tracks loaded, track one and three, you can scratch or launch or do any of your, your triggers or anything simultaneously. So you have toggle between the two decks, and uh, we've got these great pads down the bottom of the player that allow you to do your hot cue, a roll, a slicer. There's actually two modes of slicer, as well as your sampler. You have auto looping, a great needle search at the top, access to all your effects, and your four channels down the center are, uh, are in it, sort of in counterintuitive order. It's not one, two, three, four, it's three, one, two, four. That puts your primaries in the center and then your, your two outside is your secondary. You have a microphone for uh, your channel three and channel four as well. So that's a, uh, an XLR and a lot of guys wanted to have uh, two mics. So we also have a uh, quarter inch on the uh, channel four as well. Uh, this is a great unit. This one comes in around uh, 1099 and that uh, it's, it's just a fantastic controller from Pioneer. And now let's take a look at the limited edition Platinum Series from Pioneer. This is the CDJ2000 Nexus and the DJM900 Nexus, as well as an RMX1000. Now all of these have been done in a chrome, chrome plate finish on the top, so you get this uh, really cool look. And they're being done in limited quantity. There's 2,000 sets being made, so that means 2,000 mixers, 4,000 of the players, 2,000 of the RMX units. The players and mixer are sold as a combo. The, the remix unit is available separately. However, you can purchase those all together, and uh, you're best to ask your dealer for pricing because it, uh, it, it may vary. But uh, for those who aren't familiar with the CDJ2000 Nexus, beautiful waveform, uh, ability to use USB, SD, uh, record box links. So you can even connect in your iOS or Android devices as well. And uh, this is a, a top performance unit. The uh, DJM900 is a fantastic mixer. It's got all sorts of effects built in, uh, high quality, and it has built-in sound card as well. So if you want to check these things out, there's lots of videos online and the performances, but this is the new limited edition Platinum from Pioneer. And this is Pulse coming to you from the NAMM Show 2013 here in Anaheim.